Hey friends, Rachel from the Gargan. Uh, listen, I was just on my way to um, my destination and a song came on the radio and it's a song that Jet absolutely loves and I was just overwhelmed with gratitude for my little eight-year-old who is just such a little love bug and loves certain songs and just sings them so proud and oh, I just can't stop smiling and I feel like I'm constantly in this state of happiness and joy and gratitude and I was talking to somebody recently and they're like why are you always so flip and happy Rachel well first off I'm not always happy but I'd say 80% of the time I'm a pretty happy person and I'm gonna share with you why why am I always so flip and happy it's because I started this gratitude practice maybe I don't know a year and a half ago where most days, I'm not diligent enough to say every single day, but most days I wake up and I either write down in my journal or I think about things that I am really, really grateful for. So this could be little stuff like, oh my, I love my hot cup of coffee, or I love my warm bed, I love my dogs, or big things like I'm so grateful for my marriage and my husband and my ability to just go after things, right? Just, there's just so much, so much in life to be grateful for. And when you start focusing on things that are amazing in your life, you start looking for them. You start recognizing little things that are really cool about your life. A stranger's smile, um, a really good piece of avocado toast, anything. And it completely changes your day because you really and truly cannot feel anxiety or fear while you're feeling gratitude, while you're feeling grateful. And let's be real friends. There are a ton of things that can weigh us down these days. I mean, just life stresses, financial stresses, shit that's going on in the world. I mean, our world is kind of a scary place right now. And if we think about that a lot, and I'm not saying to stick your head in the sand and not think about that stuff, but I can tell you no changes will be made in this world if all we are is thinking negativity and fear and anxiety. We have got to get our minds in a much better place to make changes. So think about what you have in your life right now that you can be unbelievably grateful for. If there is always something always. I don't want to hear that you don't have anything that is good in your life because that's bullshit. Let's have a conversation and I'll I'll point some stuff out for you. Anyways, holy crap, it's getting hot in the car. It's like not even nine o'clock and it's already warm. It's supposed to hit 95 in Portland today, which is not cool because we don't have air conditioning. We've got like this little window cooler. Most people in Portland don't have air conditioning because it's not supposed to be this hot in Portland. But it's going to be a good day anyways. I'm grateful for the sunshine. See? See how I flipped that? Grateful. All right. Bye, guys. Love ya.